record. But this is the one I want to see fall. No offense to Pietro Manea, but I would like to see Mike Marsh get the mark in the 200 meters. Well, he only missed it by one one hundredth in the semifinals in Barcelona. He won the gold in Barcelona. And believe me, it's a lot easier to predict a world record than to run one. Marsh is in lane five in the blue, the middle of the screen. And he gets off to a good start. Mike Marsh already making up the stagger and John Regis. Bates from the U.S. also out well. He's right inside of Mike Marsh. Bates, a draft pick of the Seattle Seahawks, challenging Mike Marsh, but here comes Frank Fredericks. It is going to be Mike Marsh, Frank Fredericks, and then Michael Bates. 19.95, excellent running for Mike Marsh. Two golds at the Olympic Games and an American record at the 200 meters. But he wants more. He'd like to set that world record. And as you pointed out, an outstanding start for Mike Marsh. He made up the stagger on Britain's John Regis, the European champion, in just a few strides, it seemed. He said his problem in the final in Barcelona was he pressed too much the first 100 meters. He had to get himself to relax the second 100 meters. Marsh, who works out with Carl Lewis, has learned that strategy of relaxing and letting the speed come out. And here he was tested as first Bates came up alongside. And then Fredericks made a run at him, but he maintained his composure all the way to the line. It's been an outstanding season for Mike Marsh. He adds another victory. Frank Fredericks was second. Michael Bates of the Seahawks, third.